control. Can you hear that? Jeez. Yeah, it really hurts. Where, which side? Both? Yeah, both sides, yeah. I'm going to the uh, facial surgeon next week. When it's that bad like that, mm -hmm. oh, geez. Oh. it's not the muscles around it, it's the actual joint. Mm -hmm. So you've got to get the joint repaired. Sure. You can usually help when it's like minor problems, but you know, it's this bad, you can't. Mm -hmm. Is that by pulling out your beard? That's fine. I just shaved. You just <laughs> When did you shave? Mm, yesterday, I think. Does it hurt when I'm pulling on you? Yeah, it's fine though. Do you feel that? Yeah, just mm. huge knots in your jaw. Oh. Both sides wet. <sighs> You're saying it's worse than the right? Yes. It is well, more swollen over it's here. It's more swollen than the right, but the left is where the muscle is. Where it's really yeah, that muscle mm, right here, yeah, that right there is very tight. Again, this is the yeah. masseter muscle that's responsible for closing the jaw. Do you grind your teeth at night? Yes. And I, I take that uh, diclofenac in, in powder for the migraines because this gives me migraines or cluster headaches all the time. Cluster headaches? Yeah, that's what they told me. The neurologist said it was cluster headaches from, I'm not sure if it's from the jaw or the neck or a combination of both. But does it feel like an ice pick in your eye? Yes, exactly. Right behind my eye. And that's a cluster headache. Mm -hmm. Does it last like terrible pain for about yeah. 15 minutes? Yeah, it can last longer. I, I have to let just lie down if I get it. It's worse than a migraine, you know. Yeah, your eye tears up and like waters. I, I just can't remember. I just I could feel like a, I almost feel like a blackout with the pain. Yeah, they, they say that's about the yeah. worst type of headache you can have. <sighs> just going about as hard as I can in yeah, here. That's great. <laughs> you never complain. You're always like, ow, but, but keep going, keep it's going. It's nice, it's lovely. <laughs> I look, I look forward to this every week. <laughs> you look forward to the torture session every week. I know. <sighs> it is bike week. My you, God. Is it? Oh, no. That's is, it, is it bike week? Because it's like so many motorcycles That's, out. It's torture if it is bike week. I'd rather come in here. Oh. Bike week. Yeah, you Americans can't handle your pain. Don't know what pain is. Mm -hmm. yeah, Greg's from Scotland. Or do we say the UK? The UK is fine. Great Britain, UK, Scotland. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Duh. That's much better, thank you. Chiropractors are usually like the last stop before surgery. So to help my neck, and um, obviously I've had surgery in, in this and it's been fused. Because um, it was fused, um, quite hard to get the natural curve back so it is that that general like i just i sleep in it every night under under a pillow obviously i know you can't recommend that but that's all it right just yeah. helps, it just helps me a lot yeah the um yeah what, which vertebrae are fused on you c5 c5 and c6 c6 yeah. yeah that's very common area right that's mm -hmm. uh in the neck it's either it's usually c5 c6 or c6 c7 so of course you can't adjust that you go mm. up higher and I tell them to put that dental roll up here, up at the top of your neck. And get as much of a curve back as you can. And does it click less when I hold the atlas in? I think it does. If I really push hard. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. now. It's much less though. So, yeah, usually early on with people with TMJ early on, I tell them to get the atlas back. And if you can get the atlas back in, mm it will take the pressure off the jaw. I feel so good. I mean, it hurts, but it feels good. I have to go about as hard as I can until my fingers break. Thank you. <laughs> I don't mind breaking your fingers. <sighs> yeah, that's 
hard as I can, I push on there. There it goes a little bit. It's starting yeah. to let go. It's starting mm -hmm. to let go. I just wait, wait for those um, tendons to just kind of uh, 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 release. So medium a lot. Yeah. You know, what I would tell you. Oh, sorry, honey. Is that you know to place it right here? Yeah. And is that where you're placing it? Yeah, exactly there. Yeah. Right there. Yeah. And I want somebody just to sit in my yeah. head, so I thought sort of push yeah, it down. Yeah, just push it down. That's what I'm saying. I'm gonna tell people I usually just, you know lay your legs out straight. Mm. Hold it like that. This mm. just little device can do what my hands can't do. And then I fall asleep. <laughs> mm. No, it's spicy spine's buggered. It's buggered. It's buggered. A good word to use. Mm. Wonder if YouTube will recognize that as a bad word. <laughs> no. Buggered isn't word. bad. It's a very good word. But isn't bloody a bad word? No. No. No, not at all. Just kind of wiggle that. The A word's really bad. Like Americans. <laughs> Jeez. Or the I word, insurance companies. Insurance companies, that's right. <laughs> really bad. <laughs> if you want to swear, you'll just say, oh, those. Mm. Insurance, insurance companies. companies. <laughs> mm. no. It's pretty powerful. Mm -hmm. Now we see what we can get. I usually can't get much. Mm. I can't get much there. Not in this diversified movement. We call this diversified. On the left side, sometimes I can get to go. Chin back for me. Yeah, right mm. there. But the right side yes. is always so tight on you, so go ahead on your stomach. All right, mm. so the right. Are you comfortable? You okay? Yeah, I'm good. I'm comfortable now. As soon as you start touching me, I won't be comfortable. <laughs> Ow. I'm joking. All right, here we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. Good. Roll me in. Oh, God, that was good. Oh, I felt good. That's how we have to adjust Greg's neck. Roller. So relaxed now. Mm. Oh, we gotta get that one. Does that hurt? I'm sorry. No, it's fine. I'm just being American. Being American? <laughs> being soft. Being soft. We don't really have chiropractors there. We don't? You don't? No. So what do you have in Scotland then? Osteopaths? We have whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> do the osteopaths mm. crack you? They do. They do crack you. Okay. It's, it's, they're quite rare. People don't really look after themselves very well. Is it true that... Irish and the people in the UK don't get along. Well, the Irish and Irish and Scots are the same blood and very similar language. They got on well, but um, yeah, the English don't get on with the Irish and vice versa. Oh, so but then the Scots don't like the English much, and then nobody really cares about Wales. There's so few people live there, but Wales is a beautiful place and lovely people. I have a lot of subscribers from the UK. Got you. Probably about a uh, good 20% of my subscribers. Wow. Are from the UK. Because mm. it's English, you know, my videos are in English. I didn't notice. <laughs> no, but I do have some Spanish videos. And so yeah. then it'll come in from Spain, Mexico, Argentina, <sighs> Peru, Chile. Mm. Oh, big ones. So I've had two of those surgeries in the last week, ten days. Oh. It's been Maybe that's why your neck was so stiff. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You okay? I'm good. So for my chiropractic students who watch, when you see this, a scar like that, that's obvious back surgery right there. 
Sometimes people forget to tell you that they've had what surgeries they've had. Oh, have I? I forgot about that one. <laughs> on the neck, they'll have a scar on the front. Like I do. I yeah. can't forget that one. I can't see it underneath your beard. That's because I shave so often. Yeah, the next scar is very neat and tidy. This, what is it? My next scar is very clean. Um, this scar used to be clean. It's just there. Um, I just, it's hidden with the... This used to be clean, but this has been... Uh, I think it's five or six times I've been operated at the same place. So, the, the last operation, they went over the scar again. That's what... So they've opened you up five times? Yes, I believe so, yeah. If I remember. Usually the scar, you're right, is a lot thinner, but yeah. this is this is quite wide. Yes. Usually it'll be like a thin little line. You can even see where the staples mm -hmm. were placed. Oh, I, did I tell you I had an epidural last week as well? Okay, where was the epidural? Uh, down there somewhere. Usually they place the epidural around L exactly just the way you L1, place it. L2, yeah. Yep. But um, and I got steroid injection in there too. You try to stop the swelling as the inflammation. Okay. So. Did it help? Is it helping with the pain? It it really hurts the first week because that was last week. The first week it's really painful, but yeah, it um, it does help up to the second or third week. Um, the, every time I get that epidural in my spine and I get it every three to six months, it, it triggers the pain in my legs like horrendously. And it just feels like your legs are burning and, you know, stabbing, shooting pains down your legs. It, it really it, uh, aggravates the nerve. Oh my God. And then how long does it take for it to work? Well, for uh, it to calm down. That takes 24 to 48 hours to wear down. And then this is the second week. It's still. It's, it's better now, but I still get the pain and the numbness in my... It's the front of my legs that's the bad one, which you'll be able to tell me which disc that is. L4. L4, L5. So. Yeah, L4, L5. Yeah. Can be like L3 too, if but usually L1, L2 is down the side of the leg. Yeah, this is the front of the leg. The front of the leg, yeah. like we're down, not yeah. past the knee, right? Oh yes, yeah, right to my toes. Oh shoot. Mm. It is only my left leg. My right leg is okay. But don't get back surgery. If you can avoid it, back surgery at any cost, please do. You know, you, you pay for it afterwards with all the scar tissue and, you know, a lot of things. It's um, anything on your spine, just... Well, I feel like uh, once you've been cut open, mm -hmm. it's... You, you, you pretty much need to keep having surgeries. Yeah, exactly. Have they gotten any better at it? Mm, I no. guess so. No. My first surgery on my spine was when I was 18, so you were I was quite young. Yeah. Mm. Sure. That's why I'm so short. <laughs> no. Yes, it is. That's my excuse. <laughs> I guess. You could probably lose maybe an inch. <laughs> an inch? Hey, in a man's world, an inch is a lot. You might have to edit that bit out. You kind of decrease in height as you get older anyway. It's the difference between Tom Cruise and Kevin Hart, you know. <sighs> this is pretty painful whenever I do this to somebody. It is painful. This is, it's okay. This is nasty. Mm -hmm. I also, since I came to see you, I've changed my diet a lot. Okay. Um, like, I don't drink a lot of herbal tea, and I don't drink coffee or sodas, really. But, um, or cut down on the sodas, should I say. But, um, like, in places where the, t the water's over, over chlorinated, like, has so much fluoride in it. The you don't think it's that bad here in Florida? Uh, it is bad, but in Texas, I found the fluoride in the water was so disgustingly bad that you... Why do they put mm. so much fluoride in the water? Mm. Is it a byproduct, waste product? You guys think it's good for your teeth, but it is good for your teeth. I don't know it's about terrible, that. It's terrible for everything else. 
Well, I'm an expert in everything, so I'll just say it all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. That feels good, though. Yeah, it feels... Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> it's so good. Thank you very much. Does it hurt me a bit? <laughs> yeah, it hurts a lot. It's, it's good. <sighs> there it goes. One more. Cheese. Ow. Cheese, <laughs> cheese and rice. I promise. <laughs> she said Tinder or Grinder, I didn't hear you. <laughs> Tinder. No, she said uh, Tumblr. She said Tinder. But I don't even know what that is. Is that uh, dating? I think it's a dating site. You think yeah, I know it is a dating site, yes. I'm not on there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that you're with women. Did it? Yes. Uh, Again. Okay. Again? Did I get it off? No, you got it all, yeah. I felt okay. it. Mm. I need to adjust it right there. I guess. No, no, no. What? I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> Don't pop it. If you leave here, you can pop it. <laughs> No, you shouldn't be popping your neck. I'm not trying. I was just trying to stretch it, so sure. put more more pressure on it. Like if you push there and I stretch it over. All right, go ahead. Go deeper stretch. Mm. This side isn't as bad as the other side. But you know what I mean. Oh. All right, let's try back this side then. Oh, let me find it. Mm. That's an instant headache. You know, the shoot, shooting pain into my right. Well, that's right yeah, that's cranial nerve eleven. Mm, yeah. Sorry. No, that's no, fine. As the long as when we stop, it, it stops. Yeah. No. It goes up into the back of your ear. Yeah, and I. Oh. And when I stop, does it go away? Eventually, yes. Eventually. <laughs> okay. All right, ears. How's your sinuses been? Are they any okay. better? Yeah, they're a lot better, yes. Hold on, hold on. You lean away. No, we're going to go actually this way. Yeah. Good. I think that worked. There is in there. It's good. All right, here we go. Your breath in and out. Can you breathe? Okay. Yeah. Here we go. Breathe. Here we go. One, two. That's the rib that was out that last time. <laughs> You're like a break. I know, it's good. It's fine. <laughs> I've Just tried to lose a few pounds. Just cover it from here. 
<laughs> this is where I can't get on you. Oh, there's some more. <sighs> Try to open this up. Open the thoracic spine up. It feels good now. It feels good. It feels good. Get my upper back a break. <laughs> Really good. Just taking the whole sacrum and pushing down. I'm going to go the other way now. Oh, that feels really good. Traction the other side out. That's, that's really, really good. There go. Especially after that rib pop back in, it just feels... Yeah, there was oh. two of them, right? Oh, yeah, that was good. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> I think you're heavier when you face that direction. <laughs> <laughs> Mm -hmm. Feels yes. good. Okay. okay. What else, Greg? Cap, come cap. That was great. <laughs> He's still alive. Yeah, that's perfect. Ah, oh, I feel so much better. Definitely. Yeah, no, that feels great. Especially my ribs and my thoracic. Thank you. All right. It's good. It's good work, everyone. For, <laughs> For me, yeah. <laughs> Oh, was, you're like that an interesting case. You're not that like my really regular, good, yeah. um, <laughs> my regular clients that come in here. <laughs> that first rib too is good. Yeah, that yeah. One? Both, both sides, yeah. Because what, what happens when the, is, when, if, top, when I'm on like the, this, and they, there's two of them that go in at yeah. about T3 and T6. Yeah, but I feel them and they, they really like do. Like right here. Yeah. And I can only get those when walking on you. I know. I've, I'm just, you're just, you're very... I don't know why it very muscular. No, I can't anymore, get it. But, yeah, I know what you mean. but yeah. just really, uh, it's, it's very stiff. hard. So when I I can't flex the joint in order to pop it, unless I'm putting all of my weight on it. No, I and it. then it it pops because of the weight. Yeah, and it goes. It's great. It so great. unless I'm going to gain another hundred pounds, that's not going to happen. No, I don't think I could take any more weight because it's obviously not that pleasant. <laughs> no. Thank you. Perfect. Okay. Awesome.